Hi everybody, it's Island Gamer here, back with another video for you guys um, to do with FIFA 21 career mode with Man United on World Class Difficulty. Just before we get going, um, again to remind you, if you are enjoying these videos, please uh, go ahead and uh, hit the um, subscribe button so you don't miss any more. Um, this video will be uh, put into a... Um, a playlist so if you have missed any previous episode um, it should be easy to find um, the older episodes um, as well uh, just uh, have a look in the description below and you'll find that um, the link to that as well um, and the last thing is if you are again enjoying this video I would really appreciate it if you could uh, give it a like and even give me a message um, so let's get into it though um, so where did we get to last time well actually we had a really good episode last time and um we got ourselves up to fourth in the league uh so you can see we've played 13 games now so we're what probably about a third of the way through the season and uh we're on 27 points and we're actually only three points behind liverpool who are joint top with man city oh they're really close i just noticed that there's only uh one goal difference in it uh, they've both had 11 against and Liverpool have scored one extra goal so that's about as close as it gets um, and where are we in comparison to them just so we can compare ourselves uh, so they've won 9, I've won 8, they've drawn 3, I've drawn 3 so I've lost one more game than them but in terms of goal scored um, I have uh, goals for i have 46 they've only got 27 and 26 and 19 and 11 11 so i've let in more goals but i've scored a lot more and that could help me having a better goal difference later on down the line so um we'll go back to the season um and we'll have a look at the calendar just to remind you again so last three games that we played was Starting from Leeds there, which was on the 8th, and you can see I won that 6-1. Then we went to Fulham, and I won that 5-0. And then we won against RB Leipzig, and we won that 2-0. So, and just worth stating that against RB Leipzig, I actually played a weakened team. And that's the team on the screen now, it's the team that I played. Um, so, we're going to advance. And we're going to go and get ready for the game against Everton. So the reason I played a weekend team is because I was already through anyway um, and I knew that, uh, oops sorry, that's funny it's just been loaded away, I knew that um, <clears throat> the game against Everton could potentially be quite a tricky game and I wanted to make sure that I had everyone, as many people as possible with as good fitness as, as they could have. The only thing that I've rest here is um, the sharpness dropping off but it looks like I've got away with that so that's fine and Rashford is yep he's full and he played the last one so did Greenwood and he's full as well Pogba he got rested so he should be full and then I'll go down here find uh, Fernandez. Maguire is obviously going to be playing and I'll probably give by a shot again and Matic okay so I'm just sorting out the um uh, the substitutes now as well um I don't need both of them one do I so it'll be him Okay, so I think that'll do it. The one issue I've got just now is I don't have a lot of strength and depth as strikers. I think I've got two or three very good strikers. Martial and Haaland score me lots of goals. And Greenwood can sometimes go over there. But if one of them gets injured, I could be in trouble. So that's an area I'm going to have to go get sorted out at some point. But nonetheless, that's a, so that's a squad we're going to use. Um, I like that. That's plenty of... Uh, Contrast in the strip. So let's just get straight into the game and climb up that table even more. Commentary position joined by Lee Dixon. And very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It is Everton 
taking on Manchester United. Yeah, thanks as always, Derek. It's a pleasure to be here. Anticipating a really good game today. The atmosphere is great. Certainly buzzing from the spectators' point of view as we head towards kickoff. Hopefully, we won't be disappointed. Holland. Now with Rashford. Holland. Rashford. No, oh, that's unlucky. And a fine stop. Well, he's given a corner. The referee. And firing it into the area. And it oh, the ending. Oh, lovely ball. Just needs to stay calm. And able to get a body in the way. Sigurdsson with a corner. And clears it. Pogba. Here's Luke Shaw. Well, the pass not finding its target. Shaw. Playing with purpose and control. Well, he dealt with that ball played in rather well. well can they exploit the space out wide? Could cross it in here. Ruben Duarte, Sigurdsson, Eric Bailly keeps it out. Bruno Fernandes, Anthony Martial, Bruno Fernandes has it. Holland, now Paul Pogba. Well, you know, I don't think. Calvert-Lewin, this might be ideal for the counter. He will be. Ducouré. And now, passing it through. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. Don't Mason Greenwood. More than decent this from United. Bruno Fernandes and he's oh, taken no. it away well nicely cut out Shaw and now Rashford real chance he can't hold on to it and a time for calm on the ball Martial. Now Pogba. Oh, he's given it away. And that will do it for the first half. The two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Anthony Martial. Opportunity it is. Not a smart oh, enough no. cross there, but no attacker able to touch it. It will be. He's found a pocket of space. It will be. Good looking ball. There could be a chance now. Well, good defending. To intervene. Into the advanced position. Chance to cross. Bruno Fernandes. What a vital intervention. And we very much hope you'll join us for more live Premier League action on EA TV. It's Everton facing Manchester City. Yeah, atmospheres, mate. It's still alive.
Not the easiest of situations oh, no. for the keeper. United looking to forge ahead. Let's see if the corner helps them. Played into the centre of the box. And able to close down the shot. And we very much hope you'll join us for more live Premier League action on EA TV. It's Manchester United facing Crystal Palace. Yeah, really looking forward to it. Always a great atmosphere in that stadium. It should be a really entertaining match. Martial. A goal it is. Yes! One last. They've broken the deadlock. Well, it's been so close this game. Tactics have played a part. Now they're going to have to change the tactics and see what happens. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Going back down to balanced. Substitution for Greenwood. Manchester United coming off the pitch. Holland. Number 23. Luke Alex Tevez. Coming onto the pitch. Late towards the back post. Oh, oh yes, 2-0. Pure class. Had to catch it perfectly. And didn't he just? Well, here's the replay, and it's a decent move to evade the defender and then just look at the finish. Reads the flight perfectly and absolutely smashes it beyond the keeper. There's just no stopping that. So, 2-0 now. Holgate. And it's a matter of what occurs in the final 15 minutes. And crossed in there. That's a decisive punch by the keeper. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. And return to Alan. Well, it might still work out. Good technique displayed. Cuts it back. That's it. Ball is loose. Oh, no. Inside the final two minutes of this contest. Marcus Rashford in position. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the opportunity. They've lost it. More than decent this from United. Tackling and winning the ball to boot. And that is the end of the game. There we go, guys. That's another three points in the bag. Um, I'm not going to lie. I was getting worried at one point. I was uh, beginning to think it was going to be one of those games where I couldn't score and then they ended up going up and scoring or whatever. But we got the two, two new wins, so that's good. Another clean sheet even better as a bonus uh don't pay too much attention to the fact that we're up to third and Liverpool are down to fourth they've got a game in hand um but it puts a wee bit of pressure i suppose on Liverpool if you get pressure in a computer game i don't know but um yeah we are still three points off the lead so Liverpool obviously won i think Chelsea must have won as well um uh, looking at the next set of games, uh, Liverpool have uh, Fulham by the looks of it. You'd expect them to win that. Um, that's all I can really... Man City and Everton, so there's a potential there as well, um, to be fair. Uh, let's go and have a look at the office now. So Rashford is happy with the amount of games he's getting. Um, so thanks. Uh, I'm proud of you. He's getting me goals. He's making me chances. Yeah, absolutely. And I'm going to... We're going to go ahead with our Crystal Palace game. So let's have a look. Looks to me like what I'll do, just as I normally do, I'll keep swapping these guys over. Everyone else is going to stay the same. And uh, we're going to go and try and get another three points. Soon to get underway here at Old Trafford. I'm Derek Ray, ready to bring you commentary, and joining me is the former Arsenal defender, Lee Dixon. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It is Manchester United up against Crystal Palace. Yeah, thanks Derek, as always. Pleasure to be here. 
I have to say, the atmosphere is fantastic in here. And I'm anticipating a really good game today. Hopefully, we won't be disappointed. Bruno Fernandes. On to Holland. Now Paul Pogba. Terrific block there. Bruno Fernandes. Juan Bissaka. Here's Martial. Martial! Oh, really commanding oh. goalkeeping. And United have the corner. Well, it wasn't a taxing save. Not always straightforward. Yeah, Derek, it's a funny old day. It can be a day to remember, a joyous day when everything clicks. You get a good perception from the fans that once loved you, or it can be a day to forget. Hostile, you play terribly, you get beaten. He'll have his fingers crossed for sure. Excellent vision. Rashford with possibilities. In. Must be a goal! Yes! On the back of sustained pressure. Now they deservedly hold the advantage. Well, here's the replay. It's a lovely, quick counter-attack that sets up the chance. And when he gets through to the keeper, he just smashes it past him. Well, as a defender, you can't afford to take your eyes off Anthony Martial, even for a fleeting moment. In what way might he contribute in this match, Lee? Well, Derek, how do you stop him? Very difficult, I would say. He's got absolutely everything, playing with such confidence. Defenders really need to up the game today to stop him. Martial. How can they make one of these passes count? Martial. Pogba. It's there for him. Able to close oh. down the shots. Bruno Fernandes. Oh, Might be a oh, chance yes. here. Oh, pressure oh, on what's an opportunity. Still some work to do in the second half, though. With the clock ticking down before the half-time cup of tea, it's important you keep your concentration. Martial. Bruno Fernandes. Options in the middle. Can he find the net? It's gone. Oh, what a goal. Well, they're really in the mood here. Can they be stopped? Well, here's the replay, and there'll be a few accusing glances after that clearance. Giving away the ball there is criminal. And at this level, quite honestly, you get punished. Well, a second goal for them here. Manchester United. Number six, Paul Pogba. Not a huge chunk of added time. One minute. A room to roam on the wing. Rashford. Now Pogba. Bruno Fernandes. But it can't get through. The two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Luka Milivojevic. Take it away. Well, United in control with their possession and all of their team are enjoying this performance. That's why they're winning and that's why they're one of the best teams. He's in with a chance. A goal! And it seems yes. they're truly cruising to victory here. Well, here it is again. The through ball is perfectly timed. It causes havoc. And when he gets through to the keeper, he just smashes it past him and gives him no chance to think. A lovely finish. 50 minutes, please. 2-0. Many thanks, Alan. Anthony Martial. Pogba. Rashford. Well, options at the back post here. In it goes! Oh, Such a complete good. performance. That's Four sweet. in front now. Well, here's the replay. It's a really dangerous ball into the penalty area. I think that game a real cracker. You should be tuning in for that one. The referee knew that was foul play, but advance. And he might be through here. Still alive. It's opened up for him. And he gobbles up the second chance. 
disappointment for the keeper. No. Thank you. The put pitch. your head down, put your laces it's through the ball and strike it. Coming on so to deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. James. Alex Tevez. Teammate available. And a textbook interception. And he takes on the shot. Well, diving magnificently to make sure he got there. Coming off the pitch, number 20. Over it comes. Coming onto the pitch. Can he convert? I'm trying to build the head of steam. Another corner it'll be. And firing it into the area. Quite so Happy just to retain the ball in their own half and draw out the opposition. Pogba with the forward surge. Possession lost. Plenty of running room oh, in the wide position. He knows what he's doing when it comes to blocking. The delivery. And a poor ball. Crisp tackling. There's been a goal in the Manchester City match. Let's hear about it from Alan. It's a third goal for Manchester City. Four minutes remain. 3-0. Regular updates from Alan McAnally along the way. And he's through here. He oh, had just dear. the goalkeeper to possession. We have entered the final minute of normal time. And unable to keep the ball. And the electronic board has been held aloft. Three additional minutes here. Van der Beek. It's with Alex Teres. Had a chance to whip it in here. And there goes the final whistle. So what do you think about that? Um... It was good. I was disappointed to concede the goal, but to be honest with you, they started talking about the Man City game, and I'll be honest, I switched off. So that was um, that was probably on me. Um, Liverpool and Man City both won as well, so we're still well. We're we are genuinely third now, uh, joint on points with um, Chelsea, and you can probably mm, not really getting much of a gap yet um, I think there's a bigger gap getting down to 8th but in terms of getting out of the top 4 it's still pretty tight but we're still just 3 points off the top and we're playing Man City next um, so if we win that game we, uh, we, we, we catch up points wise with them um, which is really good uh, that's why I took uh, the players off uh, quite early on. I didn't want to risk injuries or anything like that. So, uh, Brazil blank, so that's fine. We'll go and put him somewhere else. Where are you? There you are. Where, oh, let me, uh, how do I think we got my scout? So, relocate scout. Let's put him into. I'm trying to think where to bother putting him. Um, I don't think I've got anyone in it. Do I have? Yeah, I do have someone in Italy. You know what? Let's try Poland. There's a certain half decent striker in Poland, isn't there? Um, you see, you never know. Right, so. Will I will I play the Man City game or will I make you wait to the next episode? Hmm. Of course I'm not going to make you wait because I want to know what happens as well. Uh, right. Let's have a look at the squad. Oh no, my shows are wee bit tired. Uh, everyone else seems okay though, so it's not too bad. Um, I'm gonna swap them over just keep the rotation going right guys so just in case you need it 
here's a reminder of how important this game is. We are f third, Man City are first. We're on 33 points, they're on th 36. Forget about the goal difference, because ours is much better than theirs. But if we win this, we go, we'll actually go above them because of the goal difference. If they win it, sorry, if they win it, then we start slipping behind again. And if it's a draw, then we risk slipping down to fourth again. But this is it. Lee Dixon in the commentary position. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It is Manchester City taking on Manchester United. Well, I'm excited about this one. Great atmosphere in here. Everybody looking forward to this game, especially me and you. Introducing the starting players for Manchester City. Ederson between the posts. Kevin De Bruyne plays with Rodri in central midfield. And playing up front today, Sergio Aguero. A chance for him to get in behind, maybe. No, not the best challenge. Excellent challenge. Well, Manchester United have chosen this particular shape. Harry Maguire plays alongside Eric Bailly in central defence. And the tactical configuration oh, has two players in attack from the very outset. Uh, what have I done? Rodri. Sergio Aguero has it. The ball with Rodri. Aguero. Good Firing it towards goal. And a fine stop. Maguire. Paul Pogba. Rashford. Crossing into the middle. And he's got to clear his lines. Not a complex. Consistent form, relentless hunger, a desire that goes beyond the norm. He's got that extra yard. He's a joy to watch. A real opening now. There we go, chance. And Ederson makes a <laughs> real. It's with Alex Tennis. Maguire. Bogba has it. Holland. United could get in behind the defence. And they deal with the threat this time. Holland. Important block by Walker. Yeah. Well, just the tackle that was needed. A deft clearance. Well, Derek, they're not happy. Ref is taking the brunt of this. Difficult to stop him. Fernandinho. Now Walker. Fernandinho. Keeping it moving dynamically. De Bruyne. This is good. stop it going in? Can he open them up here? Perfect challenge. Shaw. And Rashford. Holland. Holland. Well, in oh. some style, Ederson prevents a goal. Now the delivery. And the keeper dealt with the danger. Maguire and with that Erling Haaland it's oh, going to be foul. United's free kick he's been admonished by the referee he's now got to walk something of a tightrope yeah he knows exactly where he stands look at the referee how he's told him off there no yellow card but certainly mm. knows what the referee's thinking took it cleanly well Derek you can sense the frustration growing from the fans 
That leads on to the players being frustrated too. You can sense it. Can they get the goal? Martial, and he might wreak havoc. Oh, shoot, shoot. Yes! And there it is. The opener in the derby falls for United. A real jolt to the home fans. Not what they were expecting. Well, here's the replay. He's done really well to get his head up and pick out a teammate. And that eventually leads to what amounts to a simple task of rounding the goalkeeper 2v1. It's Manchester United versus Paris Saint-Germain. Yeah, cup football as its own. Walker now. Fernandinho with it. Delightful pass. Aguero. That's a very impressive piece of defending. And the keeper's oh, given it away down. inexcusably. Fine goalkeeping to push oh, that, that away. Silly. Wilting under the Wake pressure. Up. And now they try to go forward. Grimaldo. The ball with Rodri. And Bernardo Silva has it. Here's Aguero. Well, that's wonderful attacking play. Aguero. Here's De Bruyne. And it's gone in. I Just what was that. needed for Manchester City, who now have squared it. At this juncture, not just from one side, but from both. It's with Alex Tennis. Now with Bailly. Van der Beek. Holland. Opportunity it is. And it's in! Yes! They're back in front. Stunning scenes here. Well, here's the replay, and what a ball that is to put him through. And it all leads to a 2v1 on the keeper, which he really doesn't have any chance with. It's a great team goal. 1-1. One, one. Regular updates from Alan McAnally along the way. And Manchester City will go to their bench. Bernardo Silva. Sterling. Grimaldo, here's Bernardo Silva. Well, they had a decent reading of that ball in. Grimaldo. And a strong tackle. flag does go up must have been close they're still in this game we always used to say on the pitch when we we're losing and he's in oh hello will he finish oh good oh, save should have been finishing well they'll be looking and firing it into the area oh, oh, I, thought that was in. I thought he was going to score with that and a change to the scoreline at the Emirates Stadium Alan McAnally can tell us more it's a goal for West Ham United Four minutes remain. 3 1. Alan McAnally keeping us right up to date. De Bruyne. Chance to play it in. Rodri. Can he finish? A smart Oof. stop here. Well, this might be their final opportunity to draw level. Kevin De Bruyne with the corner. The keeper dealt with well, the Henderson. Alexander Zinchenko. The ball with Rodri. And you don't want to lose possession. Actually, let that go out. And that is offside. Oh my god, it's offside. How lucky am I? Why didn't I let it run out? Oh my goodness. One minute remaining. Can't get out my own half. Bernardo Silva. De Bruyne. That's how to rob them of possession. Yes. And there yes. it is, the final whistle. Wow. I thought I had messed up. I made mistakes in that game. I shouldn't have conceded that first goal. That was just stupid of me. And then the second goal that I thought they scored, but it was offside. Why did I get Maguire to touch it? Why did I do that?
instead of just letting him run the ball out and it would have been a goal kick but we won and what does it do to the table well let's find out oh i'm in the wrong one sorry i got too excited um here we go so that's the wrong table that's the um champions league we're wanting to look at this one wow look at that so we are one point off the top now we're leveling points with man city we've got a much better goal difference and look who our next game is against liverpool wow <laughs> uh and man city are against newcastle you'll expect newcastle to win that um so you'd expect man city to win that i should say with new well to be fair newcastle actually up in ninth so it could be more tricky than i thought um how are newcastle doing uh six six and four and man city are 11 three and two i still expect man city to win it but you never never know um but luckily um i've done really well played five won five in the group stages so i'm gonna put in a lesser team because win lose a draw i'm finishing top of the table in the champions league so i can rest people to make sure that i've got a fit squad for um going into uh, that liverpool game um but let's just have a look at what's coming up so guys you can see next two games PSG and then Liverpool then then Tottenham that's a big big ask um, to try and win all three of those games but it is something we are obviously going to do our utmost to do but that's going to be in the next episode because I'm going to call it a day here so um, to make sure you don't miss that episode go ahead and subscribe um, so that you'll get notified no, notified you'll get no, uh, a notification when the video is out and um, uh, go ahead and uh, give the video a like if you've enjoyed it as well and let me know by leaving a comment um, but that was a good that was three wins out of three wins there and um, all in all very good performance and a lot of progress made but for now guys whoever you are wherever you are happy gaming have a good day and i'll see you in the next episode